Ahoy, mateys! I be Tiger Lee, and this be Pirate Fashion. Today we're going to talk about our new women's cross-dressing outfit called the Port Royal outfit. All right, it can. It is uh, three pieces. The first is the shirt, which is a men's style shirt that's been fitted for a woman. It could be but it could be unbuttoned down, or it could be buttoned up with the detachable cravats. All right. So you could go fancy, or you could go more rugged. It has uh, elastic uh, cuffs at the wrist and then around the back. It has this elastic back here that allows it to be more fitted to follow the female form while still being able to go over the breast. All right, it is 100% cotton. Then, normally it's long, but it gets tucked into uh, your breeches. So the next item is the stretch women's knee breech. It is of a more traditional drop front trousers. Uh, so these would historically be used of unbuttoned to use the restroom, but the women will still probably have to remove the garment to go to the restroom. So it's got a nice fitted form in the back. And then over here, uh, traditionally it has buttons on the side. So the stretch only happens uh, from side to side and not up and down. These buttons are grommeted in as opposed to regular sewn shank buttons which tend to fall off these will stay on all right the last item is the waistcoat the waistcoat uh, comes in multiple colors black like you see here which look good in the traditional uh, black against red or we have a burgundy which these have two functional pockets in the front. They're very small, but you still can put some change and keys in it. And then in the back, it's got this lacing here so we can get more of a fitted look. Uh, and if you look, it is short in the front and long in the back, and it gives it a very elegant look. So it, it could be worn more men's style like this, or it could be worn more Elizabeth Swan-like with just a uh, baldric. So what I mean by cross-dressing is back in the golden age of pirates, it was taboo for women to sail on ships. It was considered bad luck. So women had to dress like men to, be, to come aboard a ship, you know, like uh, Anne Bonny and Mary Reed. And so here, you can always, if you want to be authentic, just buy men's clothing and wear it. But if you want to be more feminine in your figure and show off your best assets, then this is the outfit for you because it, it still gives a nice shapely uh, shape. And, and so it's men's style of clothing that's been fitted for a woman. So for all your pirate needs, think about pirate fashions.